guys so I wanted to come and share a quick little why do I always say quick okay so I hope everyone is having a happy Friday um, I did upload a video I'm hoping that it is uploaded by now of the date that I got my installation in and of course you guys know that I use the Eagle 2 Remy hair um, this time I got it in 16 14 and 12 because my head is like really big so what she did was of course she did the 16 at the bottom that's the 14 on the middle and a little bit of 12 to close up the top and this is my closure I'm not sure if you guys can see it but um for some reason I'm not feeling these bangs I should have just got a swoop as I started to go with my first mind but whatever so what I did was I kept the little ringlets and I haven't curled the hair since Tuesday um, with any heat on it. Of course, you guys know that I just use um, my silk, the same thing that I use on my regular hair, the silk elements, and um, that's it. Um, the heat protectant is all I use. The heat protectant is what I use on my hair. Um, again, like I said, I haven't curled it. I need to curl it. No curls. Um, the way she braided my hair this time is like, um, like that with the braid down the middle and then she braided it back up and sewed it down so it can look natural if you look close or when I've been down, whatever, whatever. So anyway, I wanted to come to you guys really quick and share something with you that I'm totally, um, not feeling at the moment. Okay, so I'm not sure if this is new, but I was reading the Vogue magazine and apparently let me just start out by saying first and foremost, I am obsessed with Katy Perry's eyes. Like her winged outliner, her lashes, like her whole like from here to here. I love it. Like I love Katy Perry's eyes. They are always so winged out. I'm not sure exactly who does her wing or if she does it herself but her wing is always amazing like her water her her lash line is always whether it's winged out whether it's deep dark like it's always the business her lashes are always the business so with that being said I just happened to pick up um, the Vogue magazine in our own office and I was like oh my god Katie Perry is in here so of course her winged out eyes were there and she was saying that she lives by it. Like she lives by it. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. She eats it. She lives by the MAC um, liquid eyeliner. And this is it. I'm not sure if you guys have seen this yet. Or what the status is. But. Um, and this one is in boot black. So apparently what happens is. It goes on shiny. But then it dries matte. And I'm wearing it today. I'm not sure if you guys can see it but I love this stuff like I've been wearing it since Saturday and today is Friday the 20 the 21st so anyway she lives by this stuff the only thing I, I mean the thing that I love about it is that like I said it dries up matte so it looks really really nice because it's, it's a boot black like it's the blackest black that they have at MAC for a liquid liner other than that pen ultimate which I'm not exactly sure what that's all about because I haven't I had it but then I took it back because I wasn't feeling it but apparently this is like what everybody lives by um Katy Perry, Mary J Blige, Christina Aguilera, Shaw, uh, Cher and so forth and so forth so of course I wanted to try it out and it comes like this yes it is um 0 0.84 um ounces mm. so it comes with a little felt tip applicator and when i say the tip is so skinny it's really skinny the only thing I don't like about it is that because it dries as a matte, like it is 
you can make it skinny or thick. I guess I have to practice on it because it's so sturdy. Like, it, it, I don't know. I, I guess because I'm so used to you using a black track, I'm used to just doing one coat and going on about my business. But for some reason, I guess I have to break the tip of this thing in because it is a felt tip. So you have to like do your lines short if that's a good way to put it. Like so. I'm not exactly sure how I feel about it, but I mean, I love it for the winged out line that it gives you. You can make it thick or skinny. I just wanted to be dramatic like Katy Perry and make mine thick. But for this little thing, like, $17. Mac ought to be ashamed of itself. I think I just need to play with it a little bit more because I'm not feeling how it goes on so light. Like, you have to coat it twice to give it that dark look. But the line, like, the winged out part is what's so, like, it's so small, you can pretty much do anything with it. So I'm feeling that little tip of it, but I don't know. I have to play with this some more. I'm not, I'm not, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Because with me, I could just use my, um, My L'Oreal Voluminous, my L'Oreal Voluminous uh, eyeliner, and this has a felt tip as well, but it's a little bit longer, and it gives you much more product. It gives you 0.95 ounces with the felt tip as well, and it does just as well. The only thing different about this is, um, this dries. You only need one coat. It dries shiny I want to say as opposed to this drying matte so I don't know about this um, eyeliner I just felt that because Katy Perry had it and her eyes are always the business that this was the trick but maybe not for me because to be honest with you I had to do two coats of this just to get this black this black but they say it's the blackest black eyeliner so I'm not too sure about that it does dry matte it doesn't move, of course, but I don't know. I guess I have to play with it some more. Um, if you're wondering what I'm wearing, I'm just wearing the boot black liquid liner with um, electric fuchsia lips, lip glass, and the fuchsia lip liner from NYX. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but just refined MSF on my the tops of my cheeks and then my Everson blush. Um, if you guys want to see a tutorial on how I curl this hair or how I roll it, I'll come back and do that. I'm still trying to get adjusted to my bangs because you guys know I'll do the part down the middle and keep it moving. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it guys. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave your messages below. To all of my new subscribers, welcome to my channel. I hope that you are enjoying my channel. To all of my old subscribers, thank you Gators so much for subscribing. Um, I'll be back later with more tutorials using the palettes from BH Cosmetics. And guys, I just hope you guys have a great Friday. And hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace.